Hey everyone, back home. It is officially March 7th. It's our last full day in Bormio. And all I can say is yesterday was a roller coaster of emotions. Um, so we started the day by, we got up early in the morning and headed all the way up to the peak. And the plan was to go up there, get some coffee, take some pictures at the peak, and then I was gonna ski all the way down. Um, we had some really fun stuff happen up there, and uh, you're gonna wanna hang out to the end of the video for all of that. But once we were kinda done at the top of the mountain, I did manage to ski all the way from the very peak. I think you might be able to see it up there. I'm gonna turn it right there. It's a I was to say, it's a long ways up there. I skied all the way from the very peak to the very, very bottom. It took me about an hour and a half of being on my skis to get to the very bottom. It did take a very, uh, well, a little bit of a long break in the middle uh, at the restaurant, get some lunch. Stephanie and I had a drink and got some lunch and then I skied the rest of the way down and we had a little drink at the bottom. At which point we came back, kind of rested for a little bit and headed off to our game. Um, it was uh, it was very it was very satisfying being able to come all the way down. I worked really hard to learn how to ski and do that, and I was very happy that I pulled it off. It was quite a difficult run. We had gotten like over a foot of snow overnight, so like it was pretty slow. And I had carving skis that were not meant for that, is what I had rented. But you know what? I made it down, got down safely, and had a great time. Uh, and the views were just amazing. At which point we headed to our match with. Great Britain and uh, my hats off to them. They played fantastic. They are absolutely wonderful. I love the Brits, um, but we did lose. So um, I will do my one little disappointment here is that it is our first loss and somehow being a double elimination, we're only gonna get the bronze. But you know what? The reality is um, this whole adventure has been amazing. Um, I hope that maybe in future games they could change that. Who knows? We'll see. Um, but it was a little disappointing to be the only team. With, and it, it would have been the same for the Brits too. I'm going to say this right now. Whoever lost that game, it was going to be disappointing because you're the only team with one loss that they get a chance to kind of climb back into it for the gold medal, like a true double elimination. And that was the only game that that would have happened for. So, but... It is what it is. Um, we're very happy, um, and it was uh, it was fun to kind of sit and talk curling with them afterwards. And um, hats off to Linda, the skip of the British team. She's uh, she had a great shot and she had a great game plan, and uh, they beat us fair and square. So um, who knows? Maybe next year we'll get you guys. So, um, but I. I think as our our competition is over now, there's still some competitions going on. We're gonna tr we're gonna go watch the Brits in the gold medal match, and we're gonna cheer for them because uh, they've been so supportive for us. And then we're gonna kind of enjoy the day here. And I guess since we don't have any competition anymore, we're just gonna try and enjoy Bormio. Stephanie's gonna go to the spa and so forth. But um, we hope all of you guys back home are great and like are overwhelmed with the support from you all. We love you guys and we miss you all. And um, as I sign off here, I will leave you guys with a quick little video clip from the top of the mountain. Um, and thank you so much for the support. We hope we've kind of furthered people's interest in curling. I've heard a lot of people talk about trying curling when they get home. And uh, also back home, hope we've furthered your guys' knowledge about uh, organ donation and the importance of it uh, through this adventure. So, but everyone, have a wonderful time back home. We miss you. We'll be home in a few days. Bye. Rick, can you do a video for a pin check? Yeah.